Hello guys, this is Anish Vidji with another tutorial on UV mapping and UV mapping is very useful I just started working with it now and it's so much easier and the cool thing about it is you just need to change one texture to change the entire texture of your rig so uh, UV mapping is basically texturing and you can use the same method to texture blocks and items uh, oh hmm. Okay, and yeah, uh, this is my rig by the way. It's a pretty cool rig, and it's UV visual circuit and stuff. By the way, so many problems. Um, people asking me, Oh, I don't have Cinema 40, uh, I have Cinema 40 R13, and there's no visual selector. It's because you don't have the full version, and if you have R12, there's no visual select also. There is, but an older version of it, um, so that there won't be as many options. and broadcast is basically a free trial i think and studio is the is the full version of it it's okay so let's get to the tutorial new ooh actually uh, let's just uh, my failed attempt at this tutorial <laughs> okay so cube let's model a minecraft character so this is the head 8888 eight, eight, eight. move this up Press E to go to the move uh, move tool. Move this 6.25, oh, 6.25 quantity size. If you don't know what I'm doing, watch my modeling tutorial. Um, so now click on the cube, make the body, and make the pixels. Now, the reason for having pixels is you can uh, later you can add some. Things are like clothes, and uh, each square has a pixel in it, so you can. Uh, it's handy to have. You can even and plus the, you can have rigid bends and stuff. If you watch this guy's tutorial on how to make rigid bends, uh, his name is Dominic something. Uh, he's. I'll put his channel link. I already have him. Uh, on one of my ch videos, so. Okay, so we just need, um, we can copy and paste the rest of the body, uh, the arms and the legs, so just make one of them. So press, select all, press C, Alt, G to group them, name it, whatever, and name the body parts, so leg, arm, body, and head. Okay, uh, so we need... Now, okay, let's get the texture. To get the texture, we need to go a uh, new finder. So click on this thing over here, and then go to your home. I don't know how to go do it on Windows. I think you need to go to app data and stuff like that. You should already know how to do this. So go to library, application support, Minecraft, bin. Right click on the Minecraft .jar, Open with archive utility, <laughs> archive utility, and you should get a Minecraft folder. Open that, go uh, arrange by kind, then find your mob folder and just use this. Uh, and you have all the mobs in here, you have all the blocks, the terrain PNGs over here, and then the item PNGs, you just have to find them in here. Okay, so now let me load it. I just edited a bit of the texture, so mine has no face really. <laughs> if you look at it, no face. Uh, so now select all of your body just drag it in there drag the texture in there now select the okay so now I want to show you some quick a uh, quick thing so go to customization window customization customization tab commands and then type in non uniform scale which is this so this is basically where you find all your shortcuts and you can make your own shortcut keys so select it. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Uh, so find it again. Click on it. You should have this shortcut thing. Just t uh, click Shift T. Then press Add, and it should add the command for it. And now, whenever you hit Shift T, you get it. Uh, you get the selection. Uh, or whatever. So now click on Live. Type Live, and then make a command for Live selection. It's a tool that we use a lot, so uh, it and it doesn't have a command, so uh, yeah. So make one minus shift Q, 
and you can find all your commands in here like uh, extrude it's over here the command is MT or D and stuff like that uh, okay so select the head we're gonna first do the head the head is the easiest because all of the sides are the same so go into BP UV edit select the layer head the head and the texture oh first we need we can't see the texture because we need to click on the magic brush thingy go and if you have a lot of materials I suggest unticking all of them except for the this one over here and just leave this as it is next next off the rescale existing textures it's important you do that press finish and close and now command Z or control Z to undo and you should have your texture right here okay so now we need to model the head so just go into polygon select uh, face select and click on the move tool and double click on your head and you should select all the faces uh, then click on this this is the texture movement whatever tool it is called poly it's called uv polygon edit mode <laughs> so uh now we need to go type in 1 and 0 0.5 if you can't see what i'm doing just change the quality of my video and make it higher press apply and then change this to 0 0.5 apply apply and then go to the snap setting snapping settings and uh, under the move tool and then go to the move change this to six three point one two five and change the scale to three point one two five and take them uh this all took a while to figure out trust me <laughs> and uh yeah so now move this onto the face if you can't see just zoom in like that uh, and then now we just need to select and move the, to the correct place move each thing to the correct place like this so that's the left side and this is the back there's a pattern if you didn't know to minecraft texturing um, and I think this is using it a lot so the front is this side the right is this side, the left is this side, the top bottom is here and the body back is here, uh, I mean the back is over there uh, it's, yeah it's pretty straightforward I guess texture. so now we just move them to the correct place make sure you have this select thing over here otherwise you can't really uh, move your textures and this is the what? The right side, so move it there. I'm the first person to make this sort of tutorial on Minecraft texturing, so I'm pretty happy. <laughs> uh, Balder Mods inspired me. Not inspired me, but he gave me the idea of using this thing, but it doesn't really work for Minecraft uh, model, uh, I mean characters. I'll show you why when we model the legs and stuff so select the bottom uh, okay I think we selected everything yeah okay and move it there uh, okay so we have everything in position now we select the, let's model the leg so let's move it out here and select UL, press UL, then go to this select. The reason I learned all the shortcut keys is so that I, I don't have to go into sta startup mode and then select it from there. So that's why you should have, uh, you should know some of the shortcut keys, the important ones. I guess I select all the sides, go back into this select, and now. <laughs> Shift T is my non-uniform scale tool, uh, the shortcuts. So I'll be using that for uh, uh, a lot. So Shift T and select the middle, which is this one, right next to this pixel. So the middle is this. Now just 
hold down and just scale it like that uh, till it fits the pixel. Uh, a box fixes the pixel. Now we should move it. We should be able to move it onto position. So into position like that. And now let's move all of this to the correct position. <laughs> uh, I think it's this one here. And then because this is the and don't worry about the other leg. I found out a way how to uh, change it so that the texture doesn't get messed up. If you see in Minecraft, the texture actually is turned around and like can't really explain, but it's not the same t texture. It's turned around the thing. I'll show you why. I'll show you later, just later. So now select this and do the same thing, Shift T, which is my command, and just scale it down to one of these pixels, and just move it into position, and that's not. I just made life a lot easier for you guys. <laughs> um. Okay, so now move this back here. And now to make the other leg, we need to uh, copy and let's go into back into start startup because we need to go back and make sure you have this object mode selected and click on Control C, Control V, just move it here. And now we need to change the size, just make it negative 25, and it should turn it around. You can't see the difference, but the texture is actually turned, so. So now it looks, um, I guess it's good now. Oh, I'm not sh I think this is here and this is here. Yeah, I think that's how it is. Um, yeah. Sorry, I switched around. Uh, you need the, le um, you need, you're basically modeling the left arm and then you just copy and paste. And then you put this at a negative and it should turn it around. And yeah, so oh, you can see it in this one. See, the textures are turned around. Oh, actually, you can't see. Oh no, you can. Yeah. Uh, so they turn. Uh, so I'm not gonna model. Uh, texture the arms. I will texture them later. I haven't actually done my own uh, UV mapped Minecraft character just yet. Uh, I'll put the download for this guy. Uh, later. Uh, I'll do a few things to it. This will be my 300 subscriber special. I'll be making uh, a rig for you guys. Uh, okay, so now we'll do the body and then that'll finish this tutorial. So let's move the body, go back into BP, UV edit, select the front and the back. The body takes the longest, but I don't care. It doesn't take very long using my technique. I modeled my rig using uh, the old-fashioned way, which is which is zoom in really far and then just texture it like that. And that took forever, and I got sick of texturing, and I had to texture my another template sort of rig thing, and then oh, I gave up on texturing. So now I found out this way of doing it. So now let's get this. Oops. And now hold Shift T and just scale it down. You only select the sides that are the same in same amount of pick uh same size. So and now we'll move them like that, deselect this side, oh no, oops, this side, and I'll actually show you how to make, I mean, yeah, well, making clothes is pretty simple, I'll make, if you want the tutorial on how to make clothes, it's pretty simple, so just write in the comments how to make, uh, and if it, if a comment, if the comment gets liked, 
few times so I will put the download I will put this not the download but a tutorial on how to make clothes I don't know if I already made one on it <laughs> but it's simple okay so now scale it down modeling is pretty easy I guess once you get the hang of it and move it to this position so that's the left side and move this here and now the last two and we're done with this tutorial yay I've been meaning to put this tutorial a long time ago but I, I was uh, I thought uh, of doing it later because it was too complicated and <laughs> now I figured out a much easier way of doing it so I'm happy I waited till I figured this thing out okay last one uh, and after you do this we have oops we have our UV map Minecraft character I will show you that it works okay so start up uh, move it if you have no grid just go into object mode and then move it here okay so now when you load in a different character so load oops uh, let's get a farmer and as you can see the legs they are different in this one see uh, if you didn't do that thing I told you it'll look like this and with that it looks like that so I I think that messed up mixed up I'm not sure but I think they were mixed up <laughs> no no they were right they were right okay so that's our Yumi character don't worry about some glitches it's okay in the render it's just the way you remapping is because it's just it's pixelated minecraft is pixels so pixels are kinda uh... they are a bit weird i guess and yeah so thanks for watching make sure to subscribe i'm getting partnership soon i hope soon and then i'll start making more animations to earn some money um... i'm not really a money fan but 300 subscribers is pretty good 300 subscribers um... that will be a 300 subscribers special a rig i think i might be putting this rig out this guy over here with this i'm not gonna put the c motion in because it's an animation and I don't want to put animations in because you just basically steal my work so and people will use it for sure uh, you need to animate your own walks and uh, animate your own things a good animator is a p uh, you can't really be a good animator if you can't if you use someone else's animation so I'm gonna take those out <laughs> uh, and everything else is good the items are, will be there Oh, where's the armor? Oh, no, there's no armor. Oh, okay. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe. And I said that twice. And bye.